Item number SCP-3403 Object Class Safe Special Containment Procedures SCP-3403 is to be kept within a secure item locker when not in use. Requests for testing may be submitted to the Research Director at SCP-3403 Site of Containment. Field Office 352 Zion, as of January 10, 2015. Following any testing or transport, SCP-3403 is to be rinsed in water and wiped clean to prevent manifestation of anomalies. SCP-3403 is a rectangular concrete box measuring approximately 17.75 cm by 10 cm by 10 cm. The object has no external openings, but contains a hollow aperture housing several materials. Following penetrative imaging and substance analysis, the space within an SCP-3403 was determined to be filled primarily with charred organic material, identified as cremated mammal remains, surrounding a small assembly composed of a circuit board connected to a dried flower Icornia crassipes, by means of short wires curled around the stem. Analysis also revealed a short text passage inscribed on the interior surface of the object the contents of which may be found in Document 3403-A01. The anomaly associated with SCP-3403 manifests when the object is fully covered with soil on all six sides. Under these conditions, three instances of SCP-3403-1 will manifest within 1,000 square meters of the spot at which the object is buried inside of 24 hours. Instances of SCP-3403-1 are incorporeal images resembling specific domestic canines. They have no measurable mass or volume, and the space occupied by their bodies measure on average 5 degrees Celsius warmer than the surrounding air. Instances behave in a manner consistent with non-anomalous canines, though they are apparently unable to detect humans. Left alone, instances will play with one another, chase non-human animals, and periodically rest. All manifestations of SCP-3403-1 cease once SCP-3403 is no longer in contact with soil on all sides. The instances of SCP-3403-1 have been designated as follows. SCP-3403-1-A Male Boxer Apparent joint pain and occasional seizures. Highly active. Estimated 13 years of age. SCP-3403-1-B Female Bull Mastiff Slight limp in rear left leg Moderately active Estimated 8 years of age SCP-3403-1-C Male Bull Mastiff Missing right ear Lethargic Estimated 4 years of age SCP-3403 was recovered from an empty lot in St. John, Florida on September 4, 2014, following numerous reports of ghost dogs in the area. No further associated incidents have been reported following recovery. Addendum Test Log 3403-Alpha Test Date September 10, 2015 Purpose Control Procedure Object placed on a tarp, not exposed to soil. Result. No anomalies noted within 36-hour monitoring period. Test Date September 13, 2015 Purpose Reproduction of Original Anomaly Procedure Object buried 0.5 meters underground in vicinity of field office. Result All instances of SCP-3403-1 manifested within 24 hours. All three instances appeared to show slight reduction of sensory awareness relative to original manifestation. Test Date September 14, 2015 Purpose Reproduction of Original Anomaly Procedure Object buried 0.5 meters underground at original site of recovery. Result All instances of SCP-3403-1 manifested within 24 hours. Instances demonstrated none of the irregularities seen in previous tests. Anomaly seems most effective at original location, 
possibly due to soil conditions. Further research ideal. Test Date September 16, 2015 Purpose Test potency of anomaly manifestation using different soil. Procedure Object surrounded in one cubic meter of soil, sourced from Brantley, Georgia. Result All instances of SCP-3403-1 manifested within 27 hours. SCP-3403-1b and C appear to have senses significantly impaired relative to original manifestation. SCP-3403-1A appear to be totally devoid of sight, hearing, and smell. Note, this suggests the earlier hypothesis was correct. Glad getting that soil wasn't a waste of time. Test Date September 18, 2015 Purpose Test Limits of Anomaly Manifestation Procedure Object surrounded in one cubic meter of beach sand, dried and sifted. Result All instances were devoid of fur, with SCP-34031-C missing several patches of skin, and SCP-34031-A completely devoid of skin. SCP-34031-A demanifested and remanifested in a regularly timed burst over 36-hour monitoring period. Space occupied by all instances measured significantly warmer, approximately 15 degrees Celsius, than recorded in original manifestation. All instances appeared confused and physically uncomfortable. SCP-34031-B observed to gravitate to areas of deep shade, to no apparent effect. Test Date September 21, 2015 Purpose Test Limits of Anomaly Manifestation Procedure Object suspended using cable in a one cubic meter tank of water with approximately 50 grams of soil mixed in. Result SCP-34031-B and SCP-34031-C manifested within 48 hours. Both instances observed to produce significantly more saliva relative to original manifestation as well as exhibited behavior associated with hydrocephalus. SCP-34031-C demanifested and remanifested repeatedly over 36-hour monitoring period, but occasionally exhibited physical irregularities upon remanifestation, such as excessive hair, elongated bones. SCP-34031-A not observed to manifest. Test Date September 25. 2015 Purpose Reproduction of Original Anomaly Procedure Object buried 0.5 meters underground at original site of recovery. Result All instances of SCP-3403-1 manifested within 24 hours. Instances showed none of the physical irregularities observed in previous experiments, though all instances showed initial disorientation and confusion for several hours following manifestation. In particular, SCP-34031-A, though apparently conscious and responsive to external stimuli, did not move for 1.5 hours following manifestation. Within four hours of manifestation, all instances returned to original observed behavioral patterns. Addendum Document 3403-A01 Commodore, Breakfast, and Lawrence Summers aren't the same anymore. This is for you. I don't even have to ask, you were always cool. GC, with help from friends.